On the morning of the 1st of April 1941, a single Junkers JU-88A5 was spotted flying over from Bridge North. The German bomber was believed to be off course and flying lower to established bearings. A single plane from the Polish Squadron 306 was sent to intercept it, but it was forced to turn back due to bad weather and low flying clouds. At 0950 hours, the German bomber flew into the cloud obscured hillside of Brownlee, crashing near the wicket. This here is the crash site of the Junkers Ju 88 plane. It took out the tops of the trees for 250 yards before crashing. It exploded on impact, killing all four members of the crew. It said the tops of the trees that it took out are still visibly different from those around them. There were still four live bombs on the plane which had to be defused. This is the memorial of the men who died on this hill. We think that the Yonkers 88 crew was the first to crash and die here. We're here at RF Cosford today to investigate uh, Yonkers JU-88. We believe that Yonker JU-88 is in the war in the air hangar, which is directly behind me. The same type of plane that crashed into a brown clee hill in, back in 1941. Mechanic Chase German Military Cemetery is the final resting place of the four crew members of the Junkers JU-88. Their names were Werner Lernhardt, Erich Wells, Henrik Ewald and Heinz Prochnow.